Hey everybody, I'm back with another video. So for today's video, this is kind of like an updated version of a video I've done before. A while ago, I posted a video and did a what's on my iPhone 11. So this video, I will be doing what's on my iPhone 12 Pro Max. Um, so we're kind of just going to be going through my phone seeing what's on my phone um yeah so let's get into it all right y'all so we're gonna go ahead and get into this video this is my iphone uh, um i almost said 11 iphone 12 pro max um so yeah it's a pretty nice size i just put this case on here i've actually never used it before but it's really pretty so i'm gonna stick with it um so this is my lock screen uh that's my boyfriend so yeah he's my lock screen and then i have a notification or whatever yeah so then we're gonna go into it and so you're gonna have to bear with me because i have a lot of different pages for some reason i haven't went through and like or organized my apps i guess semi 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 organized but not organized you know so yeah um actually i just thought about it i need to set it up and screen record so we're gonna go ahead and hit the screen record button and then you guys will see it over here over here or something so this is my first page. I think this is my home page. I don't think it is. We'll start here. It doesn't matter. So up top we have my mus my Apple Music widget. It shows the most recent songs that I've listened listened to, the most recent albums or whatever. Um I listen to music every day. That's an everyday thing. So I have my music widget um to make it easier so I can just click whatever I don't even have to do anything. So then I have my FaceTime app, calendar, photos, camera, um, the iPhone email app. I don't use it, but it's there. Um, the clock, maps, uh, weather, reminders, notes, stocks. This is kind of the page where I don't really use anything on it. The only thing I really go to on here is calendar photos camera clock i may use maps and settings so anything else oh and notes but anything else i don't really use so we're gonna go ahead and go to the next page um i have books app store you know what we're not even gonna go through all of this because half of this stuff i don't use i use app store um, you know, there's a few shopping apps on here. Stars, fitness, I do use that when I'm wearing my Apple Watch. Um, yeah, so we'll skip past that too. This page, the widget up top, used, it was for, um, I had some, like, upcoming dates that I wanted to celebrate, like, do a countdown for. Like, I went to Florida, so I put a countdown on that until I went. And then my birthday, I put a countdown on that. So, but now those are over and I have just haven't put another countdown. So, it's just there. But on this page, I use Lyft, Everyday, Entertainment. Um, I pretty much use all of these except for QB. And I think BET Plus. I use BET Plus, but not like that. Um, and then... Um, I downloaded Grubhub just to see, like, if I would like it. I don't like it. And then, you know, Starbucks, DoorDash, Chipotle. I work at Cafe Rio, so I just downloaded the app. Um, all of that. Next page. Um, so I like to read. So there's some reading apps on here. Uh, Dream. Books, Booksy is actually an app to book appointments with. So, like, if you have a tattoo appointment or, like, a hair appointment or something like that. And the person um, uses Booksy. 
you can go through the app on Booksy and book your appointment or whatever through that instead of having to get a hold of that person. That's what that is. Um, but that's going to get deleted off my phone. Um, so I have Trusted Tarot, which I actually do use. That. I have Storylight, Radish. Um, I have T-Mobile app because I'm through T-Mobile. USPS, track my mail. Next page. So my widget up top is actually a screenshot from um, a, like on Apple Music, it'll have the name of the song and then the picture to go with the song. It's a screenshot like that. And then I um, cropped it and I put it on a widget and I made the color of the widget match the color of the picture. And then you can just choose how you want your widget to look like the setup like how mine looks the battery up top the time on the side the day date all that stuff so yeah that's all i did for that and then here i have snapchat instagram facebook tiktok messenger so let's go into let's go into facebook i'll show you guys um so yeah i'm just actually go to my page here we go Yeah, I need to take that down because I posted this video and then I took it down because I didn't like it and I didn't get a good, um, like, a video uh, thumbnail or whatever. And this is what I ended up coming with, coming up with and I didn't like it so I took it down. But yeah, so if you haven't already, go watch this video. It was, it was pretty spicy. You, you like it. Go ahead and watch it. Um, and that one, my tattoos and piercings tour, and there will be more. So yeah, go check it out. Um, but yeah, so let's go out of Facebook and then Instagram. Um, oh, look at Miss Royalty. She bold cause I couldn't do it. Um, this is my page. Floridian underscore baby. Da -da -da -da. Posts. See, I don't get a lot of likes, but anyways, that's not the point. Um, yeah, there's that one. Let's go out of that. All right, y'all. My bad. Something happened. Um, got a freaking notification, and everything just went left. Um, so, anyways, uh, what page was I on? I was social media. So yeah, Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, you know, TikTok. Everybody be on TikTok. Um, Messenger. I don't even use Messenger like that no more. I don't message nobody. Nothing. I don't even know why I still have it. But yeah. Um, another reading app. Reddit. Um, it's pretty good. Not too bad. Fabletics. Which, if you don't know, they do like leggings, sports bras, workout attire. Stuff like that. Um, Venmo, uh, My Bath and Body Works, Pink Nation, and then this is Shopping, which I actually need to add more into it. Um, Sheen, H&M, Shop, Romwe, JCPenney, Cash App, and Current. Um, Google Drive, Docs, Wattpad, if you don't know, it's a reading app. And then I actually have the calendar widget. Another message. I actually have the calendar widget on here because I need to look at my calendar sometimes. So yeah. Um, on this page, I have the um, like battery widget or whatever. It pretty much shows you the battery percentage of any um, electronic that is connected to your phone by Bluetooth. So like if you have AirPods or your Apple Watch or like a speaker, once it's connected to the phone, it'll pop up here and show you the battery percentage. And it will also show you the battery percentage of your phone. So that's really awesome. I find that really convenient. Um, and then I have my YouTube widget group. Um, kids outside. I have my YouTube widget group. Um, so it has all my 
um, YouTube needs, so like YouTube, YouTube Studio, um, any apps that I use to edit videos, it's on here. Any apps that I use to make my thumbnail, it's on here. Um, when I have clips for a video that I have to put together for the video, I use iMovie. It's on here. So, yeah, there's that. Um, Pinterest, I mean, sometimes I look at it just for, like, inspiration and stuff. But, yeah, Indie, Dictionary, and then Nectar Juice Bar. It's really good. Just try it. So, that is all for... The pages. Oh, and then there's, you know, the search page or whatever. I don't know. I don't use that. Go away. Okay. And then at the bottom, um, I have the call app. I have Safari. I have my messages. And then I have Apple Music. Um, and the reason why it doesn't look like the original Apple Music app is because I started editing my phone to make it look like different like make the apps look different and stuff and i didn't get very far i did like this one and that was it so the music app is i want to say it's j cole oh no i think it's 21 savage i don't know one of them on stage singing so yeah um let me just show you guys a few um some of my few playlists that i like to listen to so one of my favorite artists is Fora. We all know this. If you know me, we know this. So I have a Fora playlist, and it's a whole bunch of his songs. He came out with um, a new album towards the end of 2020. That album's on here. He came out with a small album in the beginning of 2021. That's on here, along with some of his older songs. So, um... I think I can make this public. Make it public to where other people can listen to it. I don't know. Either way, this is my Fora playlist. It's got all his songs on it. When I feel like I want to listen to him, I have it. Um, another playlist that I have, this one's not very long, but Billie Eilish. Love Billie Eilish. So I have some of her songs on here. Oh, see? Told you. On only four songs. Not very long. Um... But I do have other of her songs, of course, in my, um, what's it called? Songs. In my songs that I listen to by her. Um, these are some of my favorites that have just come out. So, Under the Influence by Chris Brown. Love that. Um, this album, The Love Language by Trevor Jackson. Love that. Yes, yes, yes. Um, Pop Smoke, I've just been feeling him a lot. Russ, I listen to him on a daily. Provide by g Easy and Chris Brown, that's a need. That's a big need. Um, I don't know how to say his name. Brent Fias, I think that's how you say it? Yeah, he's a need. Need him in, in my life. So, these are just songs that I listen to a lot. I go back and forth between all these songs. So, that's for music. Messages. Yes. Anyways, um, you know, I text family every day, friends, um, a boss if I have to, coworkers, stuff like that. Um, yeah, Safari, Call, you know how that goes. So, I think, oh yeah, and they added an app library for your apps, which I think is really cool. Your grandma home? Somebody's home. Either way, I think this is going to be the end of my... Um, what's in my iPhone 12 Pro Max? Um, yeah, so iPhone 12 Pro Max, I don't, yeah, that's it. I didn't go into depth because, um, I don't need to. 
There's nothing in my phone. I mean, you guys saw my messages. There's no reason for you guys to see more pictures. It's just a whole bunch of pictures of me. So you're not going to see nothing crazy. Um, you saw my social media. I mean, I don't know. That's it. That's all I got. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I definitely do recommend this phone. Um, before this, I had the iPhone 11, which if you saw my what's in my iPhone 11 uh, video, then you know that's the phone I had before. I had that phone up until January of 2020. So I had it a few months under a year. And then I went ahead and got this one because number one, I usually go for the bigger phones. I have long fingers. Um, so I go for bigger phones because that's what's more comfortable for me. And that's what I like. Um, when I got my iPhone 11, I was like, oh no, I want color. Because they had bigger phones, but they didn't have the colors. They had like the boring colors. So I was like, no, I'm going to do the iPhone 11. So I had that. But then I was like, you know what? I'm really missing like having a bigger phone. So I went ahead and got a new phone in January. And um, I got the iPhone 12 Pro Max. Because as soon as I figured out which one was the biggest, I was like, yeah, that's the one I want. I don't want a small phone. I was like, I'll take the boring color. I don't care anymore. I got a uh, graffiti, and it looks really pretty. Like, it's not, okay, it's not pretty, but it looks really nice. Like, that's the best I can give it. Looks nice. I mean, I don't necessarily like the color, but I like the size. And I can always just, I'm a case person. I like to change out my cases. I can always just put on a different case. I have a clear case. I have um, another clear case. I have a whole bunch of different cases like this, different colors. I have a Harry Potter case. I have two Harry Potter cases. I have, um, what else do I have? I have so much, so many different cases. So it doesn't really matter. I can always just put a case on it and be happy. So yeah oh. <clears throat> all right but um so that's gonna be the end of this video hope you guys enjoyed seeing what was inside my iphone um make sure you guys like comment share and subscribe comment down below if you have the same phone what do you think about your new iphone 12 um uh yeah do you like the new shape or old shape considering that the phones way back used to be like this or shaped like this um like i said make sure you subscribe make sure you turn on my post notifications so you get notified when i post again because trust and believe i will be posting more often now i've gotten back into my groove you know what i'm saying so i'm back okay yeah i'm back go ahead and hit that bell push um all notifications yes 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 not sometimes not none all um because like i said i'm back so like i said i will see you in the next video uh and yeah don't miss out